A humpback whale washed ashore on Long Island yesterday, and today national and local experts work together to learn more about the mighty creature. As CBS 2's Vanessa Murdoch reports, scientists tracked this whale for decades, even named him Luna. Scientists from NOAA Fisheries and Atlantic Marine Conservation Society hard at work on Lido Beach taking samples that will hopefully shed light on how Luna lived his life and how he died. Not far away, heavy equipment digs deep into the dunes to create his final resting place. Preliminary, we know that it's a male. He's 41 feet long and he weighs about 29,000 pounds. We estimate that he's about over four decades old. So, and to put it in perspective, these humpbacks can live to about 80 to 90 years old. Since the early 80s, Center for Coastal Studies out of Provincetown, Massachusetts, tracked Luna's movement. <laughs> Senior scientist Juke Robbins shares video of him alive and well and what they learned. He spent more of his time or where we saw him the most was in the, the southern Gulf of Maine off the coast of Massachusetts. And then over time, he ended up spending more time closer to uh, the tip of Nova Scotia. Luna's favorite place to eat and the last place he was spotted in September of 2022. Our whales at this time of year should have been migrated because down to the, the Caribbean because this is their breeding season. Luna should have been on his way. What we're seeing is they're are a few more whales in, in the northern waters than there often are at this time of year. We're not sure what the reason is. Luna is the 10th whale to wash ashore New York and New Jersey coasts since December. Many questions surround the cause of the seemingly extraordinary number. In fact, in 2016, NOAA declared an unusual mortality event for humpback whales and began studying them post-mortem more intensely. The leading causes of death would be vessel strikes and fishing gear entanglement. It also could be natural causes. Completing the necropsy can take a few hours, even a few days. In some cases, the results are inconclusive. In Luna's case, scientists still work to figure it out. From Lido Beach on Long Island, Vanessa Murdoch, CBS 2 News. Wow. The Center for Coastal Studies describes the local whale population as okay because the population is slowly growing still.